Leaders of an Edmond mosque are now trying to find whoever vandalized their place of worship. It didn't involve spray paint or broken windows, but pork, which is considered offensive to Muslims. News 9's Carl Torf is in Edmond now with the latest. The discovery was made around noon on Sunday, right before a religious studies class for youth. Strips of bacon were found wrapped around the handle of the door and other strips on the ground. Tonight, mosque leaders are wondering if this act was meant to send a message as this mosque gets ready to expand. The person who did this had to know that pork is offensive to the Muslim faith. Sometime between 6.30 a.m. and noon Sunday, somebody left this mess for local Muslims to clean up. And we're not sure exactly what kind of message they're trying to send, but it, it is something that's hurtful to the Muslim community. Adam Sultani is the executive director for the Council on American Islamic Relations of Oklahoma. And this is the mosque he attended while going to nearby UCO. We've contacted the local police and, and federal authorities. That includes the FBI. This is the parking currently where you enter off university. But Sultani now wonders if this is all bigger than bacon. The Islamic Society of Edmond is expanding to three times its current size. When the plans were first debated before Edmond City Council two years ago, an outspoken local pastor took the mic. The Islamic Society of North America, which is one of the applicants, and North American Islamic Trust, which is also a owner of the property, were both listed and proven in the United States Federal District Court and the Holy Land Foundation trials to be proven affiliates of the Muslim Brotherhood, and in particular with Hamas. We're told the revised plans with the same mosque expansion go before the Edmond Planning Commission next week. Meanwhile, Sultani has hope for whoever's behind the bacon wrap. I would invite them to come and learn more about the Islamic faith. In Edmond, Carl Torp, News 9.